Hello, welcome again to another video. So today we will be doing a desk setup, pretty much a beauty desk setup. So um, I'm doing this for clients. They're trying to make this from a studio, like a beauty room studio. And I'm setting up the desk for them. So it's pretty much two IKEA Alex drawers and a tabletop. So I will be putting those together and also we're mounting a huge mirror to the wall as well. So if you're looking forward to doing desk setup or similar stuff like a beauty station, then um, I guess this video is for you. So let's get into it. Usually when I do stuff like this, I like to organize my working area. For example, put all the similar pieces together. And that also applies to screws and tools that I'll be using for the setup. And what that does, it just make my workflow a lot more smoother and also keep my work area a lot more cleaner as well. So instead of looking for pieces all the time around the place, I know exactly where to grab them from. So the first step is uh, we're going to use these screws, three of this, and these six. So we're going to need to uh, use three of this and put them on uh, these holes. So pretty much uh, there's a smaller one to one. Three. It goes to the smaller ones, and do this real quick. Remember, it goes to the smaller ones. Three, and second piece. Step two now we're gonna use this wood, this little wood, and uh, put them right right in between uh, this smaller holes. So there's two kinds of holes, the bigger one and the smaller one. So these go right into the smaller one. One, two on each side. To lay that and these two pieces are uh, connected this in, this in, this in. boom boom and second piece <coughs> Six of these ones, the bigger ones. Oh, my camera can do that. These are the bigger ones. There's two sizes, so we have the small ones and the bigger ones. So we're using the bigger ones. So tighten those screws. There it is. So step four, we're using these to um, yeah, get them in the small holes, just like we previously did for this one. Okay, and we need six of those as well. Three on each side. Now we uh, need four of these two woods again. Four of 
these. Um, let's put them right here in the vacant spaces, the empty holes. Don't matter how you put this in there. And put the screw in. We're still working with the big ones, so I think this is the last time we're using them as well. Yeah, that's the last ones. Um, Step seven, so I'm uh, gonna use the woods again. Fill the little holes. And pretty much what we do for this job, ladies, Dad. Easy peasy. First time we're gonna use some of these big screws. These bad boys. The big screws go in these holes. One, two, three, four, five, six. And uh, by the way, it's different loop as well. It's not the Phillips screw anymore. It's one of those weird five side. Oh man, my camera tripping. Yeah. Get the point. You got no problems. Yep. It's one of these ones. <sighs> Boom. It's the sweetest thing, man. Out of all this stuff, it's the funnest thing to do. Right? And by the way, I left my mic. Uh, I was thinking I could probably do a bit voiceover for this repair, but then again, um, I don't know, man. I may still end up doing that, but if not, then um, you're gonna have to forgive my sound, man. I'm using the camera mic, man. Um, I don't know how good this thing is in a quiet place, but hey. I hope you can hear me. Boom. Boom. Look at this bad boy. This goes, these are the starts. Put this in. I don't know what step this is, but nobody cares at the point. It's the last thing to do. That's the bottom. This is the top. Okay. So now we just about to start working on the drawers. And um gonna start at the the two top ones. And those are the smaller ones. So uh, the three bottom ones are bigger than this one. Um, all the one is the same process. Uh, just grab all the pieces, please. So pretty much all the slimmer pieces, pieces. It's for the small ones. And all the thicker ones is for the bigger ones. Yeah, that rhymes. I used to be a rapper in my dreams. That's the only time I can rap. Cause all of them are the same. But we only need two. 
where do we start? Uh, <clears throat> okay. We're not done with these tools here, so we're gonna use some of these. Put them at the two top holes. Right here. Smaller holes as well. They are still the smaller holes. Um, Next step, the longer ones. Uh, dun, 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 dun. Ta -da! So pretty much you're gonna try to match these lines with these lines. So it goes like this. Boom. What we need now, we need this wood again. Put it right there. Boom. Second piece, uh, so that, yep. put it right here. Boom. Um, get one of these, and always make sure you have the white side inside. Everything you screw it, either you're gonna have to unscrew it again, like take it, take everything up apart, or you're just gonna have to deal with it like this, you know. Ah, it just goes so put this like this, you slide it in. And by the way, um, also this side go to this side, you see, um. There's a little cut, a little curve, these two sides. And this is just flat. So this side goes down, the side with the curves. Put it like this, and slide it in, boom. And now we'll take the last piece. So we'll put that in here. some of these bad boys, the white ones, the white plastic stuff, goes right here, and we're going to use a hammer, the hammer as well, and usually um, the best way to get this done, I usually put my leg on the other side for support, you know, it's just uh, kind of hard to do with, you know, put these two in, just hit slightly. Yep. First one. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot, man. You're supposed to put these. Let's put these right here. This ones again, and these are the smaller ones, by the way. So. Other ones. Put this uh, uh, this one here. There it is. There it is. Yes. Yeah, so for the last three big ones. We're just going to use uh, all of these ones on all of the holes, so we don't have to use one of these in one of the woods. I mean, two of these in two of the woods, so pretty much all of the screws, so let's get to it. Uh, and for the bigger ones, 
take some two of these smaller ones as well. So, uh, right after day. Smaller one goes at the top, goes to the top. Boom. So now we're gonna use the smaller screws to uh, hold on this drawers. So um, they don't come out when you pull them all the way out. So put this back in. So what you wanna do is uh, pull this out and there's a hole right there. Right there. So. Put it here and put one this other side. Okay. Once you pull this out, it's supposed to bring the metal. So uh, now try to put this in. Get right here. This is it. So I just put the drawers together and now we just about to build a setup over there. This one right there. And it should be very straightforward. We just put the two drawers and slam this bad boy over it. Just uh, on the top, the tabletop. So uh, actually I forgot to put the studs in this one. The holds the table. So let me do that now. We got four of these. Bad boys, and they go right there. One, two, three, four. So, hold on. One, two, three, four. So as you can see, the desk is all set up behind me, and the last thing now to do is to mount that bad boy to the wall. It's a little bit on the heavy side, but as you can see, I'm the only one in here, so I'm uh, going to have to figure out a way to put that to the wall. And we also need, uh, I don't have a pencil or 
tape, measuring tape. Oh hey, we found another way to do it, man. I have this screw. Use this so mark where the screw is to go and um Yeah, let me just get into it. I got it. Oh boy. That's not stuff already. And please, please, please be careful, man. I wouldn't suggest you do this by yourself. This step by yourself. Try to get get a hand if you can. Uh, oh, no, I don't mess this thing up this. Oh boy, how it feels. Take these. Um, here for a little bit. That work right here. Oh boy. How to send it, move it, center. Nice. You just gonna love this stuff. I can tell already. And oh man, I want to show you guys like where the screws go. All right, let me make this back. So I'm gonna try to use this to make holes in the wall, and just see um, if I get the measurement accurately. Then from there, take these screws back off. This washing, uh, I recommend get these because um, they don't come with this set. But what these does is just um, how can I say? It just sold it like a lot more stronger. So recommend use that. So um, let's go ahead and do this thing. Pretty much, uh, use this tool right there. Oh boy, don't do that. Use this wash and pretty much put them right here. Boom! I swear to God, if this thing come out. Now we're just gonna lift this back up. And I might just screw it to the wall like that. Use these two screws and put this bad boy to the wall. Yes. Yep, so there you have it. That's the desk right there. It looks nice. Uh, I mean, it was a bit struggle to put the mirror on the wall. I was trying to have it like lay flat on the wall, but it's so hard because, uh, I mean, trying to 
put screws into a hose that I cannot see with my bare eyes. So I end up making a couple holes just for me to get that measurement. But at the end of the day, I end up using the stuff that comes with the mirror itself. And it was a lot more quicker. So look at this, man. Man. Isn't this a beauty? So do you have it? I think it came out very well. And I believe my clients will definitely love it because it's very spacious with a lot of storage and also the mirror. I think it's a perfect size for what she's planning to use it for. Also, one thing I like about these IKEA desk setup is that you can be very flexible with the looks. For example, you can choose to have different size, colors, different legs, or even legs on one side and on the other side, you can have the drawers. I also have the similar setup, but I chose to go with a smaller size. And also I have a leg on one side and the Alex draw on the other side. But anyway, I will be making a video soon about my whole desk setup. So if that's something you're interested in, make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't have to miss that video. The price also for this whole build is not that bad. The total is $334.99. I will leave some links in the description below if you're trying to have the same setup. But anyway, thanks so much for sticking to the end. And I hope you find value in this content. If you do, please consider subscribing to the channel and also check out my other videos as well. And also like my videos because that's going to help me. But anyway, thanks once more and catch you guys in the next one. Peace.